guys. Today we are going to be reading a springtime book. Um, it's kind of just going to be talking about spring um, and rain and how important it is and all of the good things that rain can bring even though sometimes um, we might not like rainy days because we don't get to go outside but rain is so important especially in the springtime. So this book is called Let It Rain. It is a scholastic book, just like the um, books that you guys get to order from school, right? The author and the illustrator for this book is the same person again. How cool is that? Her name is Mary Ann Coca Leftworth. And if you guys remember, the author is the person that writes the story and the illustrator is the person that draws all the pictures. So. Let's see what kind of pictures Mary Ann has drawn for us. Let it rain. It's spring. How do you think they're feeling that it's raining? What do their faces look like? They're happy, right? They're enjoying it. Singing birds, budding trees, frogs and tulips and honeybees. So beautiful. Digging, tilling, seeds to sow, planting carrots in a row. Do any of you guys have a garden at home where you're maybe planting flowers vegetables, fruit, but then heavy downpours, rivers flood, our flower garden turns to mud. Oh my gosh, what do their faces look like now? Hmm, what do their faces look like now? Do you think they're enjoying the rain now? There's a lot of rain. Let it rain. Rainbows, green grass, soccer fun, picnic and swinging in the sun. I know a couple of you guys like to play soccer, right? So even though it rains, that's okay because the soccer fields need that rain so the grass can grow and get nice and um, green and soft, right? Lambs and bunnies, puppy licks, newborn kittens, and little chicks. So cute! Building, painting, way up high, our little house in the sky. If they're building a house in the sky, what do you think they're making? What do you see down here? Maybe a tree house, right? But then, black flies, Ooh. spiders, little ants crawl inside our farmer pants. That wouldn't be fun, would it? Let it rain. Gliding, riding. Mmm, cupcake treat. Twirling, dancing, beep bop beep. But soon, steamy classroom, blazing heat. Wearing sandals on our feet. Hooray, hooray, it's no longer cool. We're heading to the swimming pool. Summer is coming, let it shine. The end. So, we still have a long way until summer, but I thought this book would be super fun to read because it's talking about spring and that's what we're learning about. 
So that about wraps it up for today. I hope you guys enjoyed this story and we will see you again on Friday morning for a Zoom meeting. Bye!